When you think of Saturn, what's the first thing you think of? Rings. Exactly. But you might have to change your thought process because coming up here in the next two years, astronomers are warning those rings are going to disappear. That's no fun. Yeah. Those rings are pretty epic. Iconic, some would say. But those, that ring around Saturn is going to become nearly invisible by the year 2025, at least to us here on Earth. Uh, that is where kind of the, the caveat is. The ring itself is not going anywhere. But this is some interesting space science stuff uh, that based off of the Earth's orbit and Saturn's orbit and et cetera, et cetera, every 13 to 15 years, Saturn's rings are directly horizontal to, I keep wanting to say the United States, directly horizontal <laughs> from our perspective here on Earth. So, and the ring is thin enough, they say, astronomers say, that it is as thin as 300 feet, you know, from top to bottom in certain spots. So very thin, much thinner than you would think. I don't know how they figure that out, how they measure that from afar. But nevertheless, it is very, very thin. And so if you're seeing it horizontally, it will be virtually invisible. Because there's just nothing there, top to bottom. But then when you see it at an angle, you can see the dust that creates Saturn's ring fanning out. Well, don't festooning let, the horizon. Don't Go let on. this bring you down. Yeah, why not? The last sentence of this article? Uh-huh. I'm sure there's people in their car this morning yeah. driving to work like, oh my gosh, my grandchildren are not going to be able to see these rings. They yeah. will. Your great-grandchildren, your great-great-great-grandchildren will see these rings. Uh -huh. Because scientists claim that Saturn's rings could vanish in as little as 300 million years. Yeah. I don't, how does that going to happen? We have time. Well, I mean, are we going to save them? Or? We're not, we can't save them. Because we have other bigger problems. Well, you think about as, as this, if too. that's even a problem. I don't even know if it's a problem. It ain't a problem. It ain't no problem. Yeah. But you think about this, too. This is what I think, uh -huh. right? And so if these rings, because one day there will be humans on the Earth that had no idea or have never seen the rings, right? I so, guess if so, we, if we so, go along that long, yeah. So think about this. Think about all the things in space that we didn't see because we weren't Ooh. around yet. Yeah. Like, we for all we know... We can't know. Pluto could have had rings, you know? Yeah. All the incredible things there in our very own galaxy. You're right. There could have been rings around Neptune, rings around Uranus. Like, you just don't know, but... What would be cooler than rings? Yeah. Like, a, what if it was, like, instead of a circular shape, what if it was a different shape completely? Or, like, when, when it's, like, wrapping around it. Like in uh, Jimmy Neutron? Yes. Uh-huh. I forget what that's called. That would be way cooler. That would be way cooler. There could have been planets that had that apparatus around the it. The nebula. That we never got. That vibe. Yeah. We never got to see that. Now that's uh, space talk. But yeah, no. Uh, no, the, these rings, they, they will be invisible through a telescope in 2025. However, then... They will disappear. We'll continue to turn, and then they'll be visible again. If you like that video, there's a ton more. Go check out our past videos and subscribe so you don't miss what we do next.